Hello, so my name is Bruce Hickton and in this video I will show you how to do a one way on over um, and calculate the effect signs. So before I start, I should point out I am not a statistician, I am not a doctor, I am not your supervisor and I will show you how to use G power but my answer that I get will not be the same as yours and you'll see why in a bit. Um, so please know, if you are planning to do anything medical related, then there are experts who are, have greater statistical ability than I do. But I will show you how to do a one way and over using G power, because it is fairly simple. So the first thing to do is we want to open up G power and we want to select our test. So because we're doing an ANOVA or one way ANOVA, it's an F test. And then we want to go down to ANOVA, uh, fixed effects omnibus one way. <coughs> okay. Then if we look at the data uh, you sent me, we can see that copying over. So we want a priori because we're calculating an effect size, but we want to do the determinant action. Next thing you want to do is make sure that effect size from means is selected because that's what we're dealing with. You can do it from variance, but um, as we've got means, we'll use this. Uh, next, you'll want to um, entering your number of groups, which is nine. Now, sometimes the groups don't kind of appear, so you have to press the up and down arrow and they'll appear. Next, we want to go through and type in our um, means. So we want to type in 20, 20, 0, 20 0, 0. 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 20, 0, 
not right. Uh, six nine zero. Three nine five. Nine five six five eight three nine five six five eight um five three four okay so once we've done that right and this is a bit which will um is where we part company in a way so if we go on to SPSS the last thing we want to do really is find out what our standard um omega of a of a statement standard sigma of the population is now to do that if we just have a look at our SPSS output you'll you can get a table of descriptive statistics so to do that you go analyze descriptives uh, descriptives put the 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 dependent variable you're interested in you know, and then click ok and it will produce a table of statistics which will be different for yours and then we just copy that and paste it in like so and then click calculate. So we can see that you've got an effect size of 0 0.02. Now if you're a psychologist that's where you would stop reporting because you've put two decimal places. Okay. Um, what you can then do is flip calculate and transfer to the main window. And you get this error message, which is the number of groups given in the effect size, that log nine, is different from the given value in the main window five. Do you want to adjust this? Yes. Okay. Uh, now according to Clark Carter, Cooligan, um, Cohen, and what you say, um, if you want to work out your total sample size, then you can just go for 0 0.8. But as we've got, um, you've already got your total sample size, um, you don't have to. You can go into post arc, you can enter in total sample size there. Four, eight, five, eight, and the group nine. Alpha being that, effect size being that. Um, find us where that is in average groups. Possibly want to do that. You can see that you get a power of zero point eight. So that's actually quite weak. But if we go back to here and the a priori um, and just go for aiming for a um, just a standard one that is recommended um, you can actually work out how many you needed if you got a power of, of 0 0.8 in order to achieve an effect uh, significant result um, so you see, you would need a total sample size of twenty um, of two seven zero three six, um, which if we compare to what we've got here, and then look here. so we've got we got an effect size of that so what you can actually see is you've got a very small effect size because it's below Point one, okay, and that's probably because you've got an equal sample size, because that does make the test um, much less effective. So, if you want to know how to reference G power, you'll find a number of references there. Have a look at this website here. And it will give you links to download the program and links to um, the references. Okay. Once again, um, please use the 
this advice with caution and remember that you'll need to change your results because you'll have different results because you'll have a different standard deviation of the population. Good luck.